And here's the thing. I, it basically says to me that there are structured craft, and we've known this for quite some time, of unknown origin whizzing around in, in our airspace, some of it uh, very s secure airspace. Uh, and that when we do scramble jets to intercept these objects, what baffles the, the observers more than anything else is the lack of any wings, visible means of propulsion, exhaust vents. Um, they have the ability to hover, change speed at high velocity, 90-degree angle turns at high speed, stop on a dime, accelerate to standstill to out of sight in the blink of an eye. We simply don't have that technology, and we haven't had that technology. So what are we looking at? We have to do the process of elimination. If it's not us, if it's not the Russians, if it's not the Chinese, if it's not people in South America, well, who's left? And you kind of have to go, <laughs> like, you know. So that's kind of, you know, what, what they're insinuating at now. James, have you, have you seen any of this with your own eyes, or this is all just in, you know, myriad stories and anecdotes from all these official people? That's the thing. It's a preponderance of evidence. It's, it's testimonials from primarily military and government officials, also some civilian people as well. And, and, but when and you you've heard just, enough of it, like... But you believe them. Sorry. Absolutely. Oh, absolutely. Why would... And I mean, when they have people say to, to you... Nothing to gain. <laughs> I got you. So when people say to you, <laughs> James Fox... Crazy. James Fox, you are crazy. What's your response to those people? <laughs> my dad did. Look, my father was a mainstream journalist. He was the, my biggest uh, skeptic for the longest time when I was producing films. And look, I'll be the first one to admit the vast majority of unidentified flying object reports are nuts. Uh, I'll be the first one to admit that. But there's a core 5 or 10% that truly are made by credible observers of truly incredible things. And those are the cases that we focus on, and those are the cases that you're looking at with this, with this UFO that they tried to intercept uh, in 2004.